What's up YouTube? Today we got another new animal to reveal and I'm going to give you a clue before we dive into the intro. So the clue is it's white and yellow and it comes from the suburbs. Cue the intro, dive on in. Before we get into the new animal though, shirt shout out, All Star Morphs. Love this design, nice and sleek, minimalistic. It's just a nice little uh, shoulder logo or breast logo on the shirt, playing on the back. I really like it personally, man. So uh, big shout out to them. Go check them out on Instagram. Now let's do our unboxing that I've already opened to make sure the animal's still alive. All right, so like the other times, I've done some new animal reveals. Uh, my cameramen are at school. So, right on top, that is the dad of this animal. And there's the breeder, Suburban Geckos. Chris is a great guy. This is my first time dealing with him, but, you know, if I'm being honest, he's got to be one of the, or if not the, my favorite. He's probably my favorite gecko breeder leopard gecko breeder i just i love the projects he's working on i love the way he presents himself uh very sleek and professional logo and stuff too now well, let's get into this of course we're gonna have to get the light box so this little girl it's hard to see with the glare let's get the light box out she spent an extra day at fedex though there was a delay in indy so let's get the light box out and put her away and here she is. I still haven't learned how to corral leopard geckos, but let's zoom out. So while I try to corral her, I actually want to put her up. So this is a white and yellow that is also 50% firebold. This is the first animal Chris has released from this project. And I wanted to get a hold of white and yellow. I wanted to get a hold of some fire bold to mix in with my bold stripe. And I also wanted an animal from Chris. So this animal fit all of those needs. And uh, look how good the white and yellow comes up the sides and on the legs and stuff. Pretty cool morph. Uh, for all the ball python people out there, white and yellow is an incomplete dominant or codom is kind of what we call it. And uh, Firebolt is a line bred trait. So, uh, what do you guys think? She's also 100% Het Tremper, 50% Het Eclipse. Look at that cool tail, man. This is a beautiful animal. And uh, let's see, what else can I tell you about her? That's pretty much it that I know of. She's going to be integral into breeding uh, for some of our projects here. So really excited to have her thank you chris she's better than expected i'm gonna go ahead and put her up like i said she spent an extra day in indy so she's been two days in a box man so i'm gonna put her up and let her get some stress off her and let her get comfortable so like i said this is the dad to that girl right there and this is a white and yellow max snow trimper albino male and this is actually the banner on Chris's Facebook page. Suburban Gecko, go over there and give it a like and follow and all that stuff. Phenomenal looking Mel, right? Uh, I plan on making uh, some similar projects. So what did you guys think of that new pickup? Man, this is sweet. I am so excited. And especially just to have an animal from Chris. You know, Chris probably doesn't even know how big of a fan I am of his, but... I've listened to his Strength and Leo podcast multiple times, man. I love that guy's mindset and everything. Seems like a great guy. Maybe one day I'll get to meet him in person. So like I said, I'm going to let her chill out. Maybe I'll name her Christina in honor of Chris. I don't know. We'll, we'll think of a name later. We'll get the boys involved because, you know, this is the boys leopard gecko deal, but I'm more than willing to take it over. Don't get me wrong. So until next time, guys. Big shout out to Suburban Geckos. Go give them a follow on Instagram, Facebook. Go check out their YouTube. I learned a lot on just how to how how to efficiently take care of leopard geckos from his videos. So go check it out. Till next time, guys. Rock on. <laughs>